Hey, Steelers Nation, before we dive into the latest news, make sure to subscribe and hit that like button to stay in the loop on all things Steelers. Our team is always on the quest for improvement, and your support keeps us going. Now, let's get to it. Breaking news. The Steelers have made an unprecedented move by firing offensive coordinator Matt Canada after a dismal offensive performance. This decision marks the first time in franchise history that the Steelers have let go of a head coach or coordinator during the season since 1941. Clearly, the offense needed a change, and the Steelers took a bold step to address the situation. But that's not all. The absence of a true leader on the offensive side has been a lingering concern. Patrick Peterson, in a recent interview, pointed out the lack of a clear leader on offense, emphasizing the need for someone to step up and galvanize the team. This opens up discussions about who can fill that crucial leadership role, especially considering Kenny Pickett's growth as the franchise quarterback. In another move to bolster the defense, the Steelers are signing veteran linebacker Blake Martinez from the Carolina Panthers practice squad. While Martinez hasn't played this season, the Steelers are strategically strengthening their linebacker depth, a key consideration given the injuries in the league. But here's the kicker. There's an opportunity to enhance the linebacker core further. Shaquille Leonard, a former All-Pro linebacker, was recently released by the Indianapolis Colts. Could he be the missing piece in our defense? Now, it's your turn, Steelers fans. What are your thoughts on the firing of Matt Canada? the search for offensive leadership, and the new additions to the defense. Share your opinions in the comments below. Your insights drive the conversation. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button, turn on notifications, and give this video a thumbs up to stay connected with all the latest Steelers updates. Thank you for your support, and let's keep the Steelers spirit alive. Until next time, go Steelers!